let's shake up the perception of salads. Often, salads get a bad rap, seen as dull, time-consuming or reserved for those on a special diet. I too once fell into this mindset until I crafted my own version of the perfect salad bowl. Trust me, it's anything but boring and the beauty lies in its adaptability. Now, let's dive into the prep work. It mainly involves chopping and washing. First up, it's the chicken breasts. Cut them into bite-sized cubes according to your preference. Place them in a bowl and let's mix up some seasoning. Sprinkle over one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of black pepper, a pinch of cayenne pepper, one tablespoon of sweet paprika, one teaspoon of turmeric powder, a dash of allspice, a sprinkle of chili flakes and a tiny pinch of cinnamon. Optionally, you can also add a pinch of MSG. Give the spices a good massage into the chicken cubes. Then drizzle over one tablespoon of olive oil. Let the flavors mingle for at least 30 minutes. Though, for optimal taste, marinate them for around 4 hours. While the spices work their magic on the chicken, let's prep the other salad ingredients. Peel and julienne your carrots and portion of daikon radish. Submerge the diced daikon radish in cold water for about 10 minutes to enhance its crispiness and texture. Using a mandolin, slice up some white and red cabbage into delicate strips. On a mandolin, you can also slice up your cucumber, but if you're not a fan, just leave it out. Next, clean and chop your choice of lettuce, opting for at least two varieties for delightful texture and visual appeal. Dice up some cherry tomatoes and a pepper. I prefer the slightly bitter green ones, but feel free to choose your favorite. Don't forget to chop up two green onions as well and add them to the salad mix. Once the chicken is marinated, heat up a pan over medium-high heat and fry the cubes until they're golden brown and cook through. This usually takes around 6 minutes. Adjust the cooking time based on your cube sizes and desired crispiness. Add the cooked chicken to your salad. Using the same pan, add 1 teaspoon of olive oil and fry the canned corn over medium heat until it crisps up slightly. Now, let's whip up the salad dressing. In a separate bowl, blend 1 tablespoon of sour cream, 1 tablespoon of red wine vinegar or lemon juice, 1 teaspoon of pumpkin seed oil, 1 teaspoon of olive oil, and 1 teaspoon of balsamic vinegar. Once you mix this well, pour this flavorful dressing over your salad and toss to coat. Of course, if you wish to make the salad completely vegetarian vegan, replace the chicken with firm tofu and leave out the sour cream. Indulge in this refreshing medley of flavors and textures. This salad will change your salad game forever. If you found this week's video enjoyable, show your support by hitting the like button. And if you're eager for more content like this, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Drop the comment down below and let me know what you'd like to see in the future videos. Until next time, bye bye!